two girls are suspended from Hortonville High School after police find an alleged kill list inside one of their homes. Police say the list had dozens of student names on it, and those responsible for writing it could be formally charged. NBC 26's Deandra Corinthios has that story from Hortonville. Students here at Hortonville High School say they got nervous, even scared, when they heard of a possible kill list. And they say when they came to school today, they noticed extra security and more police. It all started on a school bus on Tuesday. Police say a student reported seeing a video of a list titled a kill list with names of more than 60 other students. The school went into soft lockdown mode, meaning students were to stay in their classrooms while police searched lockers. A tense situation. You think about, like, People can really take that seriously, so there, a lot of things could happen with that. The school district then notified parents. It was nice to get the phone call to know that something was going on, but I think it was handled extremely well. Later that night, police say they found the list at the home of one of the students who allegedly wrote it. The investigation is ongoing. Was it a, just a very poor choice of getting attention? Was it... Uh, uh, something that may had some type of backing on it. The school district released a statement that reads in part, disciplinary processes are being followed for the students who created the list. Once the investigation is complete, charges will be recommended by law enforcement. School leaders are meeting with all the students named in the list and their parents. The district administrator says student and staff safety is their priority. She also says classes should go on as scheduled tomorrow. Reporting in Hortonville, Deandra Corinthios, NBC 26.